Welcome back to Graveyard Keeper, we keep running around. We keep doing stuff. What's that? We got some story somewhere. Okay, what we do, we go. Mm. Do I need to make... Oh, it's just glass. This is glass. Can I make ink myself? I can. But I can't make uh, these, thi these things. And I can't even train it. Okay. Okay, let's go and build whatever we must build. The body stuff. I guess I put it here because I want access to it body as soon as I possible. You know, I am already building stuff here. I didn't even ask him what is this place and what's for. Next body gonna go here. It did show me that I get some kind of soul's gratitude. How did you come to live in town? Once on a rainy evening, some judge took me into his home wet and hungry. Thanks to him I had a roof over my head and food, food to eat. He had to be one condition that I become his assistant. The judge had an old servant woman, quite well educated. She taught me how to read and write. So that's how I got my start dealing with tons of mount, mountainous paperwork and all manner of people. Uh, why did you decide to run away from town? In fact, I never wanted to run away, but it is what it is. I never expected that Bishop was just smug crook. Bishop, I know him. What, Bishop, a crook? He swindled me for a lot of money. I sold nearly all I owned. For this endowment, the Bishop promised to cleanse my soul of sins during service at a local church. And I got from him was some crappy prayer, oh, and that God will forgive me, of course. Cleanse your soul. Yeah, you know, I had enough of my boring life, I even started seeing paperwork and faces in my dreams. So many taverns, so many fights, but brothels with their puffed up lasses. Boring court sessions, endless shoutings, objections and fights. Always fights. I got fed up with it. We'll all bear our sins, that's what they teach us, right? Or so I thought, but what if one could cleanse himself of sins? Take in a fresh breath of air and be free. That that's why you're here. Oh, I see. Cleansing sins. Something broke. Oh, I can press it. Yeah, very interesting. Because those bodies, the red skulls, is sins. Means I could cleanse bodies. A good bodies is a more... Better zombies. Yes, I managed to find the keeper's book on the black market. To acquire it, I had to take all my money back from the... From that charlatan. Naturally, it's strange that you know nothing about this book, but very well. Well, I'm not the only keeper. Oh, I see. That explains why you look so lost. This book contains notes and procedures of healing a soul of its sins. Now, that's I don't understand. With the help of these broken workbenches. I also say something about healing a living soul. But damn it, some of the pages are simply torn out. You just can't trust anyone these days. Maybe we can figure it out ourselves. Oh, that's a brilliant idea. This room and all its content are to be yours. And in return you'll help me solve my little problem, deal? Well, this room is mine. 
even without his deal, because it's in my house, in my basement. Yeah, very generous, you know, come in your house and say, oh, this room is yours, now help me. What will you do next? I don't know yet, but I'll definitely have to stay here for a while. They're probably still looking for me. Do you see that door? Yes. There's some. There's a small room. I'll keep myself out of the way in there. That's cool. Uh, you don't have to worry. No stranger will find you here. That's great. Wait. What should I do? Oh, look. It says here three should be workbench with some blueprints. Uh, says here. I. You have to clean this dump up anyway. Judging from how the book is written, keepers are highly intelligent individuals. I'm sure you know what to do next. Goodbye. Hmm, what's this? Hey, Eric, do you know what is it? I have absolutely no idea. Let's see if the book says anything about the box. Well, not much. Just a smidgen of a bold text saying it's better not to touch it. But that only makes me even more curious to learn what's inside. Maybe we'll really need shouldn't touch it. The notes in the books haven't stirred us wrong yet. Oh, come on. What can possibly be dangerous? He dies, I bet. Don't know, maybe it's filled with poisonous spores? Ha! A pair of dirty old socks, more like. That's the gra greatest danger this box possesses. Interesting. Hmm. I can't figure it out. Maybe we should get some tools. No need, we manage it. That hurts. It looks like you fix it, oh ghost. What the hell are you? I have the same question, what the hell are you? I'm Graveyard Keeper and this is Eurik, town's resident. I mean, former resident. And you are? I don't know who I am. I don't even have a name. I was born in this dungeon with the help of Graveyard Keeper with a moustache. If you don't have a name, we should give you one. Let's call him Rip Zero. Eurik, something simpler for our own sake. We'll have to say it every time. Oh, that was just a joke. Fine, we'll come up with something simple. A rip is simple, actually. How about, ha, huh, I've got it. I like your expression. So we call you Smiler. Are you sure that's a good idea? I like it. It sounds funny. I gather you've been stuck in the box for quite some time. And how much time passed? I don't know, definitely more than a couple years. Seems like it. All right. Uh, it was glad to meet you, Smiler. I'll get going. I have some things to do. Okay, new blueprints. Soul container. One. And workbench. Oh, new window. Okay, these are really, really strange things. A new graveyard bed. That I like, but quite expensive. So I'm gonna be like a healer. What's the matter why you don't go in? Have I sudden grow weak? Or is there something wrong with the hatch? Try it yourself. It barely moves, won't turn any further. Looks like got rusty. What are we to do now? Will we have to break it open? Just leave here, man. Maybe you should lubricate the hatch. That would probably help. Sounds like a plan. Very well then, you get some oil and I guard the hatch. I told you nobody ever comes here. Well, I got here somehow, didn't not I? Did I not? Perhaps somebody else might come through. Go now. And worry not, I'll be on guard. I think I have oil with me. No, I put it away. Hello, Smiley. Ok, 
Okay, I would like to build these, and they're actually quite cheap. So, eight boards, eight nails, and four parts. Also, I should grab oil. Okay, I forget what kind of boards it was. Simple ones, yeah? Why did I grab that one? Eight nails. Four parts. Eight boards. Also, oil. Good thing I grabbed that oil when I was buying. Where did I put it though? It's not here. Was it outside? Didn't notice. Could be in basement. can use that to grease the hatch it has odor most peculiar yeah sure it's just normal oil not sure not no sure not such a strong recollection yet i cannot quite place you see there the oil worked the hatch is un unstuck let's go already and see what's there so he didn't even know what's there well i hope he gonna fix everything himself Oh, Fury of the Ancients, what the shit. Looks like Drunken Giant was throwing his final farewell bash. What shall we do? It's okay, we can break down all the smashed furniture and replace it with this new stuff. Really, you should help me settle in here. And if there's a little reward involved, things will go a lot more easy. Hmm, tough times, it's a deal. Hey, Eric, do you know what is this? As I understand, it's some sort of ancient artwork. There's something written about it. <laughs> yes, there. It dug up from behind the church and was reformed from several pieces. Hmm, interesting. Looks like stained glass window. It would be nice to put it in church. It's quite pretty. Sure, it's nice that you like it, but let's finish fixing my room first, then we can sort things out, alright? Skin? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. I need to fix everything. I kind of like fixing stuff. Oh, sin shard. I don't have those. Organ modification. Heart. Oh, I can increase, make it better or worse. Yeah, I see. Yeah, that's cool. Not very useful, though. Uh, what should I do now? Boards and nails. So, this is three 
three. I just can account everything and then build what I need. Okay, this is a bit later. Stick. Even beam. That's expensive part. A lot of nails, I should say. And carpet needs skin. Maybe that's why he doesn't come. It's not like I need him. I feel kind of busy at the moment. What I do need, though, is go to the town and grab that. Ink. But most likely, I'm not going to be able to buy it. I kind of, in lack of money. We'll see. Could sell that one, but it's too good. Okay, maybe I can make it myself. Real check, fast check. So, okay, I can't make that, but three feathers and one. Grab something with me. Like this one. I don't think Astrology are gonna buy it though. Oh my god, how to get money fast? I could sell some iron. Blacksmith. I don't think anybody buys food in the town. Whatever. One beam. Boards. Have just four. Out of stuff, I will just sleep. So, this is 
done. So one beam, eleven boards, four those. So nails, it was a lot. Six, six, three, six, so eighteen nails. Thirteen. Four skin, which I will never get. Skin will have to wait. Okay, I will go sleep. And finish the day. And next video gonna be sermon plus all the stuff making basement. Also, I need one more zombie. Be kind of nice. They could carry wood. But I guess it's not that important. Something more even. Oh, I forget about these. Yucks. Oops. Day is here. I wonder, will Bishop ask me about a law that his assistant is disappeared? And have I seen somebody? Pretty cool. Well, he, ma he this man is really demanding. You know, he doesn't do anything himself. Gary knows, I should ask him. New quest. Nice. So, okay, three skin. I could dig out three bodies. Then again, to cut out bodies. You need permission, and that costs. Oh, I'm not gonna ask about the tooth. Why I'm here, Gary? Do you know whose tooth this might be? Let me see. Hey, hey, that's my tooth. Give it back to me. I'll bite you, you teeth. Wait, stop! I found it nearby. That's why I came to find out who belongs to. Look, it's all old and dusty. Now I remember. One time I had a toothache so bad I didn't know what to do. Apparently I had to get rid of it. So all the broken bottles in that room are yours? What bottles? All those, well, it doesn't matter. That's it? That was a weird quest. Okay, I can sell him that 
Sermon. <gasps> Where did I put other Sermon? In the hatch? Grab those powders, though. That's all for potions. Did you finish it? <laughs> My zombie friend. That's cool. Yeah, so we can sell. So it needs to be 30. And what is now? 13. Oh, that's uh, <laughs> very fun. Oh, now he sells both. Oh, it's me. Oops. Yeah, you see. It feels like... This is like nothing. Eight times two. Should I sell it? Oh, he has better level than mine. Casual prayer. This one is better. Kind of better. I need to remember how much he need. 30. And fish. 30 is a lot. So, three skin, nay, four skin, maybe I have one, if I didn't turn it into paper. Would be nice to dug out all the bodies. Expensive though. Second way is just get carrots or donkey. Seems they started to pay more. Two silver. Two silver is actually quite good. Almost done. Or is it done? I think he failed. We still have four. Or maybe we get that one. Okay, there is no skin at all, sadly. Okay, how much it costs to get order to dig out body? Definitely have them. 175. That's a lot. <laughs> too much. Kind of too much for me. Even go further before they find some soul. I can get that one as well. This is good things. Preserving body.
Okay, you get two from one paper, but fifteen from and four from two from that, four from that. D didn't you need like three? There is a bucket. I need ten blood. That's a lot. Yeah, so st note requires story. That's very expensive. Ten. Nice. I need to learn make ink. It's kind of important. Conical flask. Maybe I should train it. Zombie alchemy workbench. So that also I need. Alchemy workbench. Zombie alchemy. Is it like zombie must work there? Zombie logistics. Zombie alchemy workbench. Oh, that's expensive one. Make this, I'm not gonna be worried about that ink anymore. I have one gold story? Did zombie made it? I didn't notice. Ah, he put it there. So smart. Oh my god, that man. I love him. I feel like I need to put second guy working here as well. And because to make those stories myself, it's very expensive. Oh, ink. Okay, I need those bottles, I have no choice. Those inks are important to me. So, black paint, alchemy workbench, so we still need alchemy workbench, and it requires conical flask, we, we may get too far. I'm gonna get black paint. Stupid. Feathers. This is easy now. So I need conical flasks. Which needs 30 points. I will never get those. At least not in sh soon.
was four boards. I forget. Get ink. Gonna be complicated. Maybe I should sleep. I don't remember what the witch wanted. Maybe I should go and help her. I mean, build that bridge or whatever. So I can't make steel glass. Okay, I will grab whatever boards I have. I did write it down, but I don't remember which one was bridge. Zombies could make boards. Maybe they can. If they're smart. We got less seeds. I need stamp. I think best action now is give carrots to the donkey and just take all organs out of the bodies and burn the bodies. Train gathering mushrooms? Oh, can't do it. Whatever.
Oh, you can't even build it from here. That's nasty. For forcing me to go around. And I don't even know if I have all the parts. I just, you know, grab something. I hope they don't need wedge. Why it's lagging? Maybe it means I should stop playing. Night is upon us too. Damn it. Where is exit? Oh. Okay, enough. Which is probably not there anymore. It's kind of night. Oh she's So I can give her cauldron. Or health potion. Yeah, but she doesn't really... Health potion? So it's not special potion, it's just healing potion. Not like memory. Wait, that's weird. Health potion. If only I would remember what it was required to make it. I remember only that there was a bee. There must be buried one more zombie. Ah? Who opened? Ah, okay. <laughs> Veggies. There must be somewhere coal mine. I remember. On first playthrough. They look different color. I guess Coleman is up there behind the buried body. I'm very really bad at making money at the moment. Like, I could do so much if I would have it. I, I need to get that stamp, then I can sell a lot of meat. And hopefully get from that. something not without energy of course
Hmm. I will grab carrots for the donkey. If they are here. I need to train so I get more seeds, otherwise I'm losing all the time. And I always need to go and buy more. I don't like that way. First I'm gonna grab Paddy. Then I'm gonna put carrots. And then I need to burn everything. Hopefully I get those 10 blood. Then I can give bucket to snake. He gonna give me stamp. With stamp I can sell that stupid uh, meat. Get rich. And dig out all the bodies in graveyard. Oh, there was no body. Breaking so long. Oh. That's a weird place. I love it, like a forest. Where it even leads? Small house. I can sleep here. Okay, something is really weird. Well, maybe I can just sleep. Kind of laggy. Yeah, I think I'm gonna down here for now. I'm gonna wake up and this is end. didn't save. So weird. This is ore. This is rock. This is rock. This is well. This is... The mine is full of toxic gas. If only I could find someone who doesn't need to breathe. Yeah, who would that be? And there on the corner, there must be coal. Yes, and I'm gonna gather that for now. It's very cheap. Gives you a lot of coal for... You see, like 20 for a couple of taps. Way better than burning wood. I can grab full inventory and just dump it into the uh, smelter. You know, and that's that's it. I will have forever. Okay, that's enough. Hm. What is this place? Nice. Carry it with me. Oh, that's the zombie. Well, is he here? No, he's not here. Whatever, man.
could get more. <laughs> Better not. Oh my god. I'm gonna punch something. Dumb call inside. It will be all right for all my life. Could dump something here as well. Pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna sleep and save and that's it. Thanks for watching, see ya.